Hello everyone, welcome back to Beamerhead. My BMW E90 broke down with no warning. Everything was fine, I parked it for 10 minutes and when I came back, pushed the start button and nothing was happening. So I had it towed to the garage, plugged in the diagnostic tool and sure enough, I found the code for the starter motor. Now to take the starter out, you have to take apart pretty much half of the engine bay. Because this thing is located underneath the intake manifold and you don't have access to it from underneath. So let the wrench fest begin. As you can see, with the intake manifold out, there is plenty of space to remove the starter. You have to disconnect the wires and there is only two bolts holding it in place. By the way, the battery has to be disconnected for this job. I'm sure that's normal. Or not. But let's find out. To take this apart is really simple. There is only two long bolts and two screws holding it together. Straight away you can see there is a lot of black dust inside and that comes from the contact points. These gears don't move very well, so they need to be cleaned and some grease needs to be added. The rotor and stator are very dirty as well, so they too need to be cleaned. I'm not sure if you see here very well, but I'm pretty sure I found the problem. The contact points are completely destroyed and that's good news. They only cost about $20 and the starter motor will be as new. Here I'm using 2000 grit sandpaper to clean the surface where the new contact points will touch the rotor. At this point I have all the parts as clean as they can be. So it's time to put them back together. Because the contact points are spring loaded, they come with this plastic wheel for an easier install. From this point on, it's the exact reverse process of everything you've done so far.
After you have everything back together, reconnect the battery and clear the code. Now fingers crossed that everything is fine and I don't have to take it back apart. Job well done! Now clear all the codes that might have been generated after taking it all apart and you're done. Thank you for watching.